welcome to another Let's Play on Total War Shogun 2. This time a sponsored Let's Play by my Emperor patron, Sir Reznov, who asked me to do a Siege Units Only challenge run on Shogun 2, which I might add is one of the more difficult challenges I imagine uh, I have done and will do ever. That, that was definitely a complete sentence. Uh, anyway, just to show you what exactly that means, we're playing as the Hojo, of course, um, and we will be allowed to use all the units in the Stealth and Siege Units tab, uh, including the Kisho Ninja, because it is still a Siege Unit. Um, it has firebombs as well, and other types of grenades. It has more grenades than the firebomb for, uh, does, so there you go. Um, so anything in here, including Hanzo Shadows too, which honestly I might actually get in this campaign. I don't really tend to go for Kisha Ninja or espe well, especially Hanzo's Ninja, but possibly in this case it will happen. Most of these units are actually had in my top 5 worst units of Shogun 2, uh, although the Fire Rockets I put in there as well, and I now disagree with my choice at the time. But I would have replaced them with Kisha Ninja, so there's that. Anyway, let's, um, let's get into the game. Uh, I will be playing this on normal difficulty because, uh... Sir Reznov also said to me, do this at whatever difficulty you feel comfortable at, because Legendary is going to be impossible. The main unit that I will be get for a long time is the Firebomb Fur, which is an absolutely disgustingly horrible unit. Especially when it's the only unit you have, um, and nothing to protect it. It's just, it's not going to be very good. Um, so doing it on Legendary is suicide. It's not going to be possible. Well, um, it might be possible, but I'm not going to bother trying it. So um, even between normal and hard, I figured let's just go normal. That's what I do most of my challenge runs at. Uh, it still makes them challenging anyway. And I think this one is just going to be stupendously difficult regardless. Uh, yeah, the rest of the settings are those. Um, so we're, yeah, playing as the Hojo. Uh, I'm not going to bother watching the cutscene and stuff because we've seen that many times before. If you want to do that, please feel free to watch my Legendary Hojo campaign. Uh, I will say I'm using free mods, the free mods that I've been using for a while now, they don't change gameplay uh, whatsoever. One of them is the camera mod, which allows me to zoom out further in battles. Uh, the second is the Vestator unit mod, or whatever the hell it's called, which makes the units look slightly different, a little better, more versatile. And the Sengoku Jidai campaign retexture mod, or whatever the heck it's called, which makes the campaign look, uh, campaign map look a lot better. The links will be in the description for those free mods. Anyway. Let's start the game. Start the game already! Don't want that. Don't want you. And I especially Eva. don't want you. Right. We got a quest or a mission, actually. I should probably have a look at that. It's just getting rid of this army, I believe. But Defeat an army belonging to the disgusting peoples. All right, we'll do that. But first, be gone, thoughts. You're not allowed. Right, so right now we have two units to our name. Our daimyo by the name of Hojo Uyuyosu and this man, Kasahara Ujitane. Welcome. Um, you're gonna go back in Sagami because let's not have you stand outside. So yeah, this is the only unit we're gonna be able to recruit for a while. I had a look at this earlier. Uh, the Kisha Ninja is the second unit we'll be able to recruit, at least if I focus on it, which I will do, uh, because we honestly need a, a melee unit to at least make it so our frontline units don't just die, or well, our, our siege units won't just die immediately. Um, but the next unit that we get after that is all the way down here, which is a Hojo Fire Projecting, projecting Mangonels, which isn't even a good unit. This is the, the, t the number one worst unit in the game, according to myself. Um, and then after that, we will get um, the Hojo... Hand mortars, which are basically slightly better versions of the Hojo firebomb first, but they're still terrible. Uh, and the much better units, which is unfortunately all the way in the arsenal, the final building, the Hojo fire rockets, which is actually the only good unit we get in this campaign. Besides, I guess if you want to go that far, Kisha Ninja, but they're only good because they're the only melee unit we have. Well, we have generals, but we can't really count them really. Um. So yeah, it's going to be tough. I'm not allowed any gunmen or anything like that. Uh, I'm also, it's not like, it's siege units only. Uh, it's not, I'm going to go for this because I want the morale. Because I honestly need plus one morale. Um, it's not siege only, so I am allowed to just fight field battles and stuff, of course. It's not that I only am allowed to fight siege battles, but it is siege units only. So, anyway. Um, so yeah, that's that's that, kind of. Um, we probably need to get this pretty soonish because I do want to have any kind of upgrades I can get for my men, really. 
I almost tempted to go for melee attack just so I can actually have 40 units. Even if it's only 40, at least they can kind of fight and not aren't just worthless. Um, I want to get a sake then soon, just for so I can get a ninja as well as the extra wealth. I, I want to get a market obviously, but I think we're just going to get this to in, to make this into a stronghold at some point. Just build both. So I guess for now we'll make a sake then. Might want to go immediately on this as well. Um, I also want to get get the harbor upgrade too, but I guess yeah, we'll start we'll start with that. Immediately go for that wealth. Wealth shouldn't really be too much of an issue. This unit on legendary, I believe, costs 176 or something. On normal, it's 119, so pretty big difference. Um, yeah, I do want a harbor, but eh, let's just focus on this for now. Imagawa, do you want trade? You do not. Speak. Okay, do I, can I get alliance? I wonder if I could have gotten alliance with them if I had asked before I removed all my units, but that wouldn't have been fair. No, this is okay. I'm, I'm, I'm okay with this. Do you want there to be my vassal? No, how weird. Um, and a receptive audience for you. Honestly, like, I might want to make that triumvirate that always happens here. Except they don't want it, so there goes that. Just out the window. Uh, they could attack, but I think we'll be okay against these four units. That should be fine. Um, besides that, nothing else to do, so let's end our turn. And possibly our life. Oh god. Rain right. fire upon the enemy has a death. No, no it doesn't. No devastating effect here. Alright, Master of Strategy of Attack, we get a fire projecting Mangano. Ah, oh, might be worth making a detour for that, just to get a fire projecting Mangano. I mean, the thing is, it's terrible as a singular unit, because, well, it's just terrible in general, really, but as a singular unit, especially, because it slows down your entire army just for one unit, that isn't even good. So I'd kind of want, like, four of them or something. I don't even know if I want like both fire projecting magnals and cannons or none. Maybe I just go for 19 fire rockets and hope for the best. Maybe a couple of Kishun Ninja to hold the line a little bit, but... Thing is, all my units are going to kill my other units, is, is the problem. Like, my Kishun Ninja are going to be holding a line. They're going to get killed by my fire rockets. If I hold your firebomb throwers, hold the line, they're going to be destroyed by other things as well. Just Even if I only have firebomb throwers, they're going to kill each other. It's, there's no holding a line here. Everything is devastating. Anyway, keep recruiting those men, please. Uh, I need to change you to development. Um, okay. What should I build now? I could get the coastal village, but I can't build anything else if I do so. Uh, I guess it's still fine. Yeah, sure. Alright, Bushido next turn, so no extra morale for this battle, but that's okay. Do you want to trade yet? It's unacceptable now. Alright. Sure. Alright, let's have ourselves a fun little battle. Here they come. Alright, it's in their favor. Kind of expected that one. They have a Daimyo, a Light Cavalry, four Yari Ashigaru and two Bo uh, Oh, I should also note, note that um, my loading screen should be pretty fucking fast now compared to what they were before because... Well, I already had the game on SSD, but it was kind of busted. I have a new SSD now, as well as a new CPU, RAM, and motherboard. So my PC is actually kind of stupendously good now. I'm running the game completely maxed out, which I wasn't before. I already had a pretty decent PC, but I couldn't run it maxed out at 60. Now I'm running it at 60 FPS, completely maxed out, anti-aliasing on 8 times. Um, and the shadows on max, everything maxed out, basically. Uh, and it's still 60 FPS. And I'm recording it. That as well, so. Okay, they're coming from two different sides, which is really good. Because that means we can focus on that one entirely. Where's the light cast? Probably over here. Okay, that's good, because we can make them climb the wall. So you are gonna go here. Uh, probably on this side. Not sure exactly what I'll do, but sure, go over there somewhere. Then their archers are gonna be climbing the walls, because I can just sit back here. I'm probably going to dismount them, but it kind of depends. If their archers come up first, I might just charge them once and then dismount them, like run them away and then dismount them and then charge them in again. But for now, this is good because we can just have this unit focus fire on these units without getting interrupted. Unfortunately, this is here, so it's going to kind of block some stuff, I guess. I don't exactly know where they're going to climb, if they're going to be on this side or that side. 
either way we should get a couple volleys. The only thing that a firebomb furrow is really good at is defending a wall. Because they can just chuck bombs down while men are climbing the walls and it's it's good. But anyway. But yeah, happy with this PC upgrade. I haven't tested really any other games yet, any other Total War games I should say. But Shogun 2 maxed out now, 60 FPS, no problem. It's fun. It's still gonna lag if I leave my camera uncontrolled. No, it's not. Wow, it doesn't even do that anymore. That's crazy. I've never seen that. Maybe with more units on the field, but I don't know. They've already lost morale. That's interesting. Alright, so their archers are still up front. We need them to climb up first so we can charge them with the cavalry. Can't wait for the first volley here. Usually units will stop for a second as well to, like, gather up and then they'll start climbing. So hopefully that's when we throw our bombs and we'll just do stupendous amounts of damage right away. So that unit's gonna climb here. This one hopefully takes up all this, and then that one can't climb. That would be the perfect thing for us. I'm gonna keep you here to deal with the rest of these units, and then I guess I'll have these guys deal with all this. Yeah, perfect. That's exactly what we want. Okay. So let's run you guys over here-ish. They are... Not sure what they're gonna do, but they're coming into range, so... I'm gonna assume that whatever's gonna happen around there is gonna be good for us. But I kinda wanna see it as well. But I also need to pay attention to this. We can sh hopefully see one bomb. Oh, here we go. They're trucking over there. I want to see shit here, though. Oh, here we go. Here we go. I mean, that was kind of good, but they also kind of just missed a lot. So, well, not as good as I would have liked. Uh, I should wait. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, go now. Need to be careful that the Yari Shigaru are also coming up. Not a great charge, really, but... Um, okay, you're still fine. Do not start getting off there yet. Our general is in grave danger, my lord. Where is their Yari units? Oh, it's coming up now. Okay, we gotta back off here. We need time to dismount as well. You get out of there! What are you doing? I can't dismount them if there's stuff over there. Oh, time for you to get off. Oh shit! All right, you need to dismount. You need to get over here. Okay. Alright. Oh no, don't go outside, you fucking fools! You fools, what have you done? Catch them. You gotta keep you gotta keep all of them busy. It's the only way that's gonna work. Alright, you need to find some way to not be caught and throw bombs at the same time. I didn't catch this unit at all, nor did I catch that one. That's two different units. Oh, for f Okay. Oh, you broke them. Perfect. Go get them. Leave my horses alone. Leave those horses alone. I chuck in there. Without hitting my own men, preferably. That's obviously... Not something we can guarantee. That's firebomb for us for you. They're chucking right at my own men. Right. Morale should be pretty well debuffed here. That's good. You, oh my god, I just destroyed my own unit. Didn't I? Keep chucking. Wavering. Yes. Don't throw towards my own fucking men, please. Uh, Alright. We've broken almost everything. These guys are coming up now. If I can chuck some bombs at their general and shit while they come up, that'd be fantastic. Get over there, save my fucking daimyo, please. Get on the wall here. No, don't attack. Just get on the wall. Quickly, if you like. Okay, they've broken. Perfect. Don't know if I'm gonna have a chance to even throw anything. These units are coming back. That's fine. Just come back here. They'll break probably before even anything happens. Oh, there's archers down here now. Okay, they're firing at my generals, which is actually good in this case. I don't want this guy to get hit. You need to not be in combat anymore. You need to not be hit by any arrows either. Okay, we're getting off now. We chucked a few bombs, killed a couple men maybe. If we can get here in time, we might be able to throw another volley. But that's probably not gonna happen. You need to get over there. Stop that general from doing anything. We need to kill that general quick, because they're all coming back. You need to stay out of this. You need to block that. Okay, can you fucking throw one volley, please? No, I'm not even going to take that chance. Just get out of there. Okay, here we go. Um, 
Maybe chuck a couple bombs on their general if we could. Because these guys are all going to come back and this is not good. Chuck at their bow units. No, they're down there apparently. Chuck at something. Just chuck. Please, for the love of God. Make sure morale stays top top. Oh god, that's all my own men right there. No, nope, they're coming for you. No, they're not. Pretty men. It doesn't matter if that unit dies, though, is the thing. So I really should just keep firing and make them a sacrificial unit. Oh, here comes a fucking archer unit. Where are they going? If we can kill their general, they just rout. Probably. Hopefully. Oh, there goes one unit. Their general's fallen. That's a pretty good sign. There we go. And... That unit somehow... There you go. <laughs> the only unit that was still going for some reason. Alright. We did it. Kind of lost a lot of men in the Daimyo unit, unfortunately, but the other one is still quite good, and the uh, Firebomb for us are essentially untouched. Good! And a heroic victory. A good way to start off this campaign, I'd say. Hopefully that's a sign of things to come. That would be... make me very happy. For sure. Fuck, that loading screen is fast. Okay, they do have 405 men remaining, which unfortunately means we cannot do shit. <laughs> but wait for them to come back, so... Alright, we got our dreaded force now. That's good. Uh, no, we don't want that. I am honestly tempted to get the fire objecting Manganel. But it's so bad! You can't even move it, can you? I think once it's set up, that's it. <sighs> okay, so we definitely want to go... Yeah, we want to do that. We want to go down here. And we want to get Todafukun before us then, so that's good. I think we just get this one later. Later. Alright. Capture Musashi. Well, that's not gonna happen. Can I even... Can I even beat that? Like, I'm wondering if I should go out and try and kill them. Their archers will destroy my firebomb first before I even get close. They wouldn't destroy my general, but... I could probably dodge most arrows, but it kind of depends. If they focus on these units and ignore my generals, then there's nothing I can do about that. What are what are so Kagawa are dead? Wow, who the fuck it? I think I'm just gonna have to let them get back and come at me again later, and then I deal with them then, and then we just go or something. I don't know. They're probably out recruiting me, but I can't get to their town. Otherwise, that could be an option. Just ignore them and just take their town behind them, but that's not gonna happen. Right. Uh, I could get this, but I think I'm going to. I really want to get this, but I haven't got the food right now to back that up, so I need to get this first. I am recruiting you now already, am I not? Yes, I am. Good. I could also save it, and then next turn I could upgrade the harbor for sh Wait, I can do that anyway. No, I can't. Because I need to recruit a unit, and the harbor is like 1700 or something. So I won't be able to recruit a unit. So I could do that. The harbor would be quite useful to have. But is it more... No, it's not more useful. I'm just getting the farm upgrades right now. They're both barren, I believe. Yeah, so we get that one, because it's the more valuable time. Right, have you changed your mind about that? No. What about that? Our yes, you have changed your mind. As in, you don't want it anymore at all. Yep, nor do you. Okay. Uh, yep, we have Chi. Nothing there to see. You have already been changed. Sure. I wonder if that was attacking me again. I mean, they still have an army. It's not very big, but they might think it's bigger than what I've got. Oh, dickheads. No, oh, you f Oh, that's... Well, okay, maybe I'll attack them now, since I have an extra unit. What a great clan dead. The... Who the hell dies this quickly, normally? Have we discovered the Honma somehow? No, we haven't. Um... Otomo? Oda. Oda? What the fuck? I can't even- wait, what? Oh yeah, they own Owari. Wow, because I, I looked at that and I for some reason thought that wasn't their town. But okay, Oda are dead. That doesn't happen very often. On Legendary, but it does on this difficulty, I guess. It's not even the cost, it's just that... It's annoying. Fucking assholes. Uh, right, so we want a unit, which luckily we can still re recruit. Um, and I guess we will up 
Yeah, I could do that now. Or I could... I would get this, but they busted it, so I can't, unfortunately. Roads are meh right now. Armorer, or we save up for this. I do really need to get this for money reasons later on. I think I'm gonna just get this right now, though. I can always cancel it next turn. Right, do I go and kill them off now? It's only three units. Yeah, I think we gotta. Otherwise they're just gonna destroy this and then they're gonna keep going back and forth and destroying everything I've got. Haha, I might have... Actually, that might... No. It reduces accuracy, but it's... I mean, I've got free range units too, so... Um... I don't... Yeah, it's, it's just... No, it's, it's no road there. Blah. There's no real reason to do that. Uh, okay, if they take that forested hill, that could be good for us, actually. Basically, we want them to sit back and do nothing. As long as I... As long as they focus on my general. Their archers, that is. And I can just run my archer unit... Or my general unit back and forth while they fire at my archer. And then my... Or, while their archer fires at my general. <laughs> and then my... Firebomb for us, we'll just chuck at their units and just kill them. That is the ideal thing to have happen here. So if they take this, which is likely, that's what we'll go for. Maybe they'll just come for me. I don't know. Nope, they're taking that. Exactly what I thought they would do. Alright. Well then, we shall travel there. It will give us cover, so we shouldn't take too much damage from them, which is good. The archer up front, 113 men. They're going pretty close, actually. I wonder if I'll be in range. Uh, you are the only unit. You can't be seen in. No way, you're my dino. Oopsie. Hold on. Okay, let's run you guys up here. We'll walk you guys up there first. Pretty sure their archer is coming towards me, which isn't necessarily good because it might start firing a dish unit instead. I mean, it's coming, so I guess that's good. I could even try and just run up there with my generals and try and kill him. I don't really want to use these generals too much, but again, in the forest, we wouldn't take too much damage, so. Alright, that gives us a chance either way to run you guys up here. So, regardless of what we're doing, we should do that. So you charge and you get in from the back. I'm not gonna take any damage here, really. Kill the general right or the archer right away, and it'll be pretty good. Or at least do a significant amount of damage to it. They're not responding, so. There you go. Completely shattered as well. Treacherously meant to ambush us! No, they're treacherously meant to ambush us, those guys. Okay, just. Get into position. What? Oh, what the fuck? How is running back turn into attack them immediately? Okay. We're gonna. Oh, for f are you throwing out my own goddamn general? Is that what you're doing? All right, we're gonna take a we're gonna take a bit of a break here. We're gonna make them chase us for a little bit while we get into a good position. You should probably stay up here. Make them chase you. Okay, we'll go up here. You guys are just gonna set up properly. While well, you guys distract them. It's only two units. Our general is in grave danger, my lord! Lost the guy right there. Oh god, stop going back in there, you fools. Alright. Okay, this is what we want. What the f- There's One tree! There's one tree here! How did you manage to do that? The first fucking bomb that gets chucked is hit hits a fucking tree. How unbelievable is that? All right, we just out of range, but now we're gonna bring him back in. Hopefully, I can throw this unit in there. Yeah, it should be okay. All right, we're all set up. We're gonna go through. Oh god, get out of there. Okay, that unit's gonna break, I think. No, it won't. That's not good. Setting back up again now. 
How is that unit not broken yet? Quite surprised. We've not really done damage to it yet, though, to be completely fair. There you go. Just in time. We shattered it. Oh god, you're running straight at this unit. Oh, I mean, this is too risky. we got to bring it around first. Good stuff. It is a lot more entertaining fighting battles like this, I have to admit. You kill them, I'll make sure we're not fighting another battle after this. Because all of us are going to be impossible in this campaign, I reckon. Yeah, Shane. Stay away from them. There we go. Was... We never really got a good free unit volley, unfortunately, but. How did you chuck a bomb over here? Hi, that's nowhere near your range. What the fuck? <laughs> Alright. That was a pre- did you see that? A bomb landed next to my fucking general. Alright. No problem. Dealt with them dudes. I might want to move up and actually besiege them next turn, but it kind of depends on what they've recruited. They have 24 men remaining. No, they don't. They have a general upgrade. Perfect. Perfect. Alright, well, either way, we can't get... Well, we can get back in town, actually, but... Ooh, that's probably really good for us here. Oh, why not siege units? I don't think that exists, actually, but still. Uh, if that counted, though, it would have been insane. I'll take the morale, though. That's actually pro quite good here. So I could probably get back, which would improve, re re improve replenishment. Um, also, I... Yeah, I did the right thing. Okay, it's, it's been a while since I've played this game, in, in all fairness. Um, I want you... Check out. There is a singular unit. Uh, I can't besiege him right now, can I? No, okay. So yeah, we'll stand here. That's fine. I'll take that. And then we'll besiege him next turn. If hopefully they haven't recruited anything by then, but I suppose we'll find out. Right. Let's continue onwards to victory. They recruited a singular unit, right? Right, yes, Todofuku, that's all he wants. Singular is okay. I don't know what it is, but it's likely Ashigaru. Um, so we'll probably siege him out. I could do that. No, we can't. Well, we could, but it's, wouldn't, it won't work. Maybe he'll stand and fight, because my army is so fucking terrible. Plus it's normal difficulty, which means I'm pretty sure he stands and fights. Yes, oh, it's also actually legitimately about half anyway, so it's not that weird. It's an archer unit, which is probably good for me. Oh, fuck, we're, probably not, we're not even going to be able to auto the to town fight, are we? God damn. <laughs> anyway, um, bit of a short episode for a first one, I guess, but I don't really want to do another battle here, so I'm going to end it here. Thank you guys very much for watching. Thank you, Sir Vesna, for my... well, for your patronage, even and for sponsoring this campaign for your patronage. Um, hopefully you all enjoyed. I shall see you next time. Until then, have a good day and goodbye.